Karens are always getting themselves into the weirdest of situations. Today, we'll be looking at an hour-long compilation of Karens doing what they do best. First up, we have this couple having a small wedding ceremony with just their closest friends and family. After the bride says her vows, her new mother-in-law has a few things more to say. Right, and I'll have you arrested. Well, Tony, get her out of here. Let's this is not right. Church, Tony, this is not. Sorry. Let's respect the wedding. I'm not leaving. Right. Just, just hold your you show respect. Like, you have your daughter's Let's just calm down. Let's say, hey, we don't need this. Yeah, this is yes. the best one. We don't need this. I don't want to hear any flaws about All right. You have the flaws right now. Are you kidding? You don't know how to act like an adult. I have the flaws. You don't know how to act like an adult right now. Are you kidding? I gave that man $500 because he wanted to live high and mighty. Oh, my God. This is not your day. It's not about you. No, but she's not talking about flaws about my son. It's not about you. It's not about you. She's in love with your son. Talk about a monster in law. Okay, this one gets quite intense. It's a wedding at home with what seems like just family. You wouldn't expect anything to go wrong, right? Well, wrong. The Reverend really messed this one up. We have invited Tier Stacy and Nicole as they promise to face the future together, accepting whatever may lie ahead. In the time they've been together, the love and understanding of each other has grown and matured. Now, they have decided to live their lives. Sorry. Wait. I'm going to show you. 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 I'm Oh, he did not just do that. And that groom definitely is not going to make it to his honeymoon. He found the reverend on Craigslist. good prank it really was super realistic i thought there was going to be a cat fight coming up with the reverend and the mother this next one is from a show called say yes to the dress now this young lady is dress shopping but her karen of a mother wanted to steal the limelight honestly i'm not really sure what my daughter wants my dress that i vision myself in is that it very sophisticated oh yes let me try this one. Oh, and chassis too of course it's her day um, the mother has had her time and now she's intruding on her daughter's wedding. So bad. The annoying part is that Chasty, the daughter, still wants to make her mom happy, so she tries on the dresses her mother chose for her. I know my mom would like it. I would compromise with embellishment. As soon as I walk on this dress, I don't see my mom. Is she coming? Is she lost? <laughs> oh my god. Hi, Chaz. How much of a Karen do you have to be to ruin your own daughter's wedding preparations? Here we have a Karen and Ken duo that apparently love harassing people outside this building. In this case, the man's daughter is getting married inside and he has to miss an important part of the ceremony to deal with these two. So then um, I suggest you call him no, or call you. the police. Why or uh, call the police? because you you're accusing me of a crime, correct? What I'm asking you is why are you- And I'm not this? answering you. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. So you, your choices are to call the cops if you believe I'm calling a crime, and I will more than be happy to talk to them. Okay, thank you. What's your name again? I'm Lisa. Lisa, what's your last name? What is your name? What's your name? Well, I asked first, Lisa. Crime, what's your sir? name, sir? Robert. What's your last name, sir? What is your first name, sir? I, I don't, I'm not answering, I'm not talking to you. You're talking to me. I'm asking you the questions. Well, we're not doing anything illegal. Neither am I. Okay, actually, so you are. are actually really? Property. Oh, okay, well then, call the cops. 
Will do Lisa and Robert. Yeah. I'll be right here. Okay, thank you. They really just walked away because they knew they lost. Take that, Karen. This clip is about to turn from something so beautiful to something you wish you were a part of. Because what the groomsman does is unacceptable and he needs to be taken care of after this. <laughs> called for. They ruined the walkout ceremony. Next up, we have a Karen who is against interracial marriages, but proceeds to book the couple for the venue and only on the day did she tell them she won't allow it. First of all, we don't do gay weddings or mixed race. Okay, so because why not? Because of our Christian race. I mean, our Christian belief. Okay, we're Christians as well, so yes, what, what in the Bible tells you that? Well, I don't want to argue my faith. No, that's fine. We that's just, yeah, we just, we just don't participate. Okay, so that's your Christian belief, right? For some, it's the best part of a wedding when the bride throws her bouquet. But this one just doesn't end well because the two ladies that end up catching it were sure to have a few disagreements. <laughs> now that is one way to end it. Well done to them for not being complete Karens and ruining her day. Here, we have a Karen who thought it was a good idea to go into a shop and ruin 32. Yes, 32 dresses because she lost a deposit on hers. How petty can one person be? <laughs> <音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音> Now, she is definitely going to get a hefty fine. You'd think that she'd think about these things when she's pregnant. She's literally committing a crime. Another bouquet toss. This one is much better, though. It seems like they're just dying to get married at this point. I wonder where their boyfriends are during all this. One, two, three. We got two fighting for it. This is pretty good here. Let's hear it for all of our single young ladies, folks. Blue. All right, we're going with blue. Blue is the blue team to have the. I think you have to chest it like in basketball. they made up afterwards. They kind of looked like sisters. This one isn't much of a Karen, but he does ruin the wedding and gazebo by not taking a seat when he wasn't feeling okay. And so, hang on to this, I'm gonna get you home. Oh my god! <laughs> How about some water? Somebody wanna get some water? 
I do hope he was good though. First up, we got a woman named Lacey. She's a current that destroyed this couple's relationship. So now you want to tell me you're not sleeping with my husband? Is that what you want to tell me right now? What? What? Seriously, Lacey? Lacey, you're sitting in my husband's car at 11 o'clock at night, so drunk he's got to take you home. Okay. Okay, what? You don't have anything to say? I want to hear it because I can't wait. Here he comes. We'll get his version of it, too. Yeah, she's not here, right? Yeah, she's not here, right, guy? Yeah. So now you want to tell me that this isn't happening? I can't wait to hear that this isn't happening. Yeah, look at him for comfort, honey. Look at my husband for comfort. Why do you think this girl's called Last Call Lacey? Why do you think she's called that guy? She sits in bars late at night with other people's husband and, and pounces on them. Next up, we have a cop that pulled over a real Karen, but this one was different. <laughs> Oh, yes. Um, how long have you known this woman for, sir? Uh, about now. Yeah, not bad, bad. That's my wife, sir. That's your wife? That is my wife. Really? Well, I have no idea. I don't know what to say. I know what the words. Can you please stand back near your vehicle, sir? Sure. I can't believe this. I can't believe it either. So I'm going to need you to go back in your vehicle and you can leave. Let me go. Yes, yes, sir. You can leave before I get angry. Grab the stuff. Yeah, that's fine. I'm trying to say before I go, we are both victims of her things. No worries, mate. It's not your fault. You're not the married woman who made Tinder. No worries, mate. This man came home to a Karen and a Ken. Hey, bro, how you doing, man? All right, boss, what's happening? All right, so you you, you with my wife? What's up, boss? That, that's my wife right there. Okay, well. All right, dude, turn the camera on. All right, that's my wife. All right, I don't know what you're digging for, but that's that's my wife right there. And I want a divorce, okay? Will you give me a divorce? Will you give me a divorce, please? Please, give me a divorce. I don't want to deal with this anymore, okay? I'll turn the cam I'll turn the camera off, all right? Here's the key. I'm done, all right? I'm done. I'm done with you, okay? I love my daughter. That's the only thing that's important to me, okay? I have no beef between me and you anymore. This next male Karen tried to skip line for a new Xbox, and it did not go well for him. If you wanted to be in line, you should have came out at the same time the rest of us did and been here the same time all this time. No, no, dude, you can't just come over here and line jump like that. What the fuck is your problem, dude? Right now, bro. You can't really do that. You can't come over here and manhandle over here everybody because you think you got some kind of privilege going on over here. You can't fucking do that. What the fuck's wrong with you? I got my kid and my fucking nephew out here for fucking hours. You ain't gonna fucking line jump. You ain't gonna fucking do that shit. Bullshit, we ain't in fucking line. Bullshit, we ain't in line. You ain't gotta move. You ain't gotta move, but I'm gonna tell you, you ain't gonna make it in time. No, you ain't. Call the cops. I, I suggest you do it now because you came up here trying to be threatening, saying that nobody. Yeah. You, the line's back there. This next Karen cheats the system by walking through the drive through line. Yo, don't talk to my girl. Coming up, we have a Karen who is surprisingly shocked that she can't just walk into a doctor's office. For a Karen that actually cheated on her husband. Yeah, he did. Oh, you did. Got my number, and then he was like, "It took his time to text, actually." Yeah. But yeah. Okay, that's amazing. So it looks I think like we're almost. 
Yeah. Yeah. Mm. We're right here. Okay, so is it next to this this blue Toyota? Huh? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. How do I know that? Okay. How do I know so conveniently is this blue Toyota? This is my wife. Your wife. Your wife. Oh. oh my god. Huh? This is your what husband. were you doing with this guy? This is huh? your husband. Yeah. yeah. We're married. We've been married for five years. You know what? Get out of the car. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get out of the car. Go. You you stay in here. You don't come with me. You don't come with no, me. I can't. I'll come with you. Oh my god. Hey, listen. Okay. Get up. Listen. Go. Okay, man. Oh. Next up, we have Gmo's video of when he caught his wife cheating. I know it kind of messed up, and y'all think I'm happy, but I'm not. I'm mad as hell. I had 12 hours to think about this. Just imagine hearing somebody that you love that lay side you all the time, every night. You hearing conversations that she talking to multiple dudes and planning on going to Texas in your car. So I'm making this to all my family that love Nina Duck, Crystal and Nina Duck, this girl right here, that love this girl. I don't want y'all to say that I ain't give her a chance, and I don't want y'all to say that I was wrong. I got my dad and mama here, but they ain't on the camera. I just want y'all to know this. She finna come through this door, and I'm a fool like I'm a singer song, then I am gonna play the, the video. Let's not forget this gem where Karen literally tried to cheat her way out of an argument by screaming. Karen, you're not gonna sit there and flip me off. You what? flipped me off. You don't touch me. Do not touch me. You flipped me off. What touch me? I don't care. I Why did you flip? Why did you flip me off? You were totally calling me Karen. Ma'am, did you don't touch me? Do not touch me. Did you, ma'am, did you or did you not cuss me? Did you no, not? I was did you flip me off? You don't understand. Why did I get flipped off? You don't understand. Why did I? You're a Ma'am, I'm a I don't understand. Karen, you are you don't okay? Understand what can you explain to me calmly? No, because you're attacking me right now. I'm not attacking you. Ma'am, you flicked me no, off. You're ready to take it. Guys, this is her license plate number. She lives no, here. No, this is her address. No, this is not true. No. Karen, you flipped me off. No, you true. cut me off no, and flipped me off, and now you're, you're playing the victim. Ma'am, would you like to calm down? No, you're attacking me right now. Guys, she flipped me off. She literally clipped me off and then she tried to come home. She's carrying. We have a man and his son pestering a woman and being racist. They end up getting arrested. Then why are you badgering us and not tell helping? tell me what they did in law is it when, it, when it comes to a line Sir, of people. I told you what it was. You did not tell me. To go to the end of the line, she says. It does not say go to the end of the line. It does not say go to the line. Here's the paperwork. Okay. Assist us. As soon as the rest of the Why no, are you this just sitting the there taking the up time and not assisting us and telling us to go to the end of the line? You know that's not even right. Maybe in your country it is where you're from. <laughs> you don't know what the, you don't know what you're talking about. You don't know nothing about ADA laws at all. Period. Okay. You can't this even is, tell me what part of the law book yeah, it's This is a different country. I'm not sure what country you're in. Enough of that. We're in America. Yes, America has laws yes, for the disability. Yes. You're sitting there saying, yes, you are. No, you aren't. Oh, Why don't you do the paperwork? So we're yelling is polite. Get the cops here. I want the police here. This man just assaulted my son. Yes, he did. He took my camera. That's assault. That's robbery. That's theft. Get my son here. Thank you. What happened? We're disabled. We're disabled. Come on. That's fine. Come back to my office. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. This we guy right this guy here, we want to pass charges on him. Next is the part two of the previous clip. Their conversation definitely was not private. Why are you here for my stickers? I passed the... Is that all you need? That's all. And she wouldn't even do that even. She and she was, allowing the, she was allowing the other uh, uh, clients to badger us. Right. I'll get, a, I'll get your stickers. Thank you for the I appreciate this conduct. I can't believe it. If I don't stick up for my rights as a disabled people, who's going to do it? Understood. Understood. You okay now? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I just think about being all stressed out. I, I know, that's yeah. part of, I know. Part of I know. my illness. That's why I can't that's stand in line. That's why I'm trying to calm you Yeah, that's why I can't stand in line. She kept telling us to go to the end. What's with the camera? 
it's, well, that's because what you do. Well, because people violate my rights. No, no. I mean, oh, was the guy, guy grabbing it? Yeah, that's robbery. That's no, that was. He grabbed the camera out because we were we were videotaping with the lady. He said percent. he was going to take the memory out. Oh, I got gotcha. you. And keep it. That's you robbery. Have the right to do anything. All right. I'm going to get you your sticker. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, everything's there. Thank you. Do you need to get the memory? Right. Right. Man, no, Norman. That's not supposed everything to happen. Everything is, is on the paperwork right yeah. now. That is not supposed to happen. That was a personal conversation you were having with the lady. You know? Next up, we have the time security guards found a woman's keys and broke into her car. I uh, lost my key outside. Oh, in the mall, apparently. We watched the rest of our movie, and I come up. He's on my driver's side, and he's on my passenger side, searching my, my vehicle. Um, somewhere in the mall. I don't know, you can ask him, he said he found it. And then he didn't turn it in. And instead of him reporting it or doing his job correctly, he goes and searches my vehicle. Cash is missing. I can't tell you exactly how much, but he has cash in his pocket. And then he goes, I don't carry cash. Why would I have cash on me? So why do you? It's 10 bucks, 15 bucks maybe. And it was in my middle console. I don't care about the change. I just want to make sure everything's in my vehicle and that they're handled correctly because that's stealing. Now she goes to check her car and this is what happens after. The girls recognize one of them. They just pull everything out of there. That's fine with me. I know for sure it's cash. Oh, five, 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 five. go to your vehicle. Check all your compartments. Oh, it was two, two, two. Uh, Eddie is on there. Just search Eddie. I know that kid. I know that kid. The tall one. I know him. What? Coming up is an entitled man with the shortest temper. You don't know me. Nobody knows anybody. Nobody knows anybody. I am. I am. You're in the handicap space. You're in the handicap space. Listen to me, Listen to me. I want to knock you the f out. You hear me? There's 200 people I don't watching. give a f out. I don't give a f Because you're a f Look at your f mouth. Watch out. You, watch out. you better watch Excuse that me. door. Excuse you better me. watch that door. You Why? better watch that door. Why? You better watch that Why? door. Why? You Get put that door in me again. I'm going to knock you the f out in front of 200 people. Oh, 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 oh. You're assaulting me. Dude, don't deliver the food. Leave me alone. You're a piece don't. of Next is an entitled man that cut in front of 30 cars in a drive through line. Everyone's waiting. Are you, you're better than everyone? Did I say what? Entitled man parked in a no parking zone. She then takes matters into her own hands, and this is what came of it. Guess he's not leaving till he talks to me. Because all he had to do was ask me if he could park. Ask me. That's it. I would have said, Yeah, dude, park in the back. I'm gonna charge you. And now I'm gonna teach you a lesson. So tell me, you just park here? Yeah, I just dropped my family and I Did you ask me if you could park here? Took just like do you know this is my business? Yeah, I know. And this is my best parking spot? Yeah. And you've been here for an hour? Yeah, I'm taking an hour. Oh. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Did you ask me? No, uh, we gotta we gotta move it now. Well, we're moving it now. Oh, it's gonna be really hard with those on there, isn't it? See this? That's a lesson. No no, it's not sorry now. You use me. You came in, you came to my shop, you acted like you were just me and your friends here, you might take some bikes. Then you park here. Don't ask me. 
this is my business. I need these parking spots for my customers. If you had have asked me, if you just had have said, can I park here for an hour? I'm a nice person, I would have done that. But you didn't. You're a nice person. Don't oh, I'm not, care. because you got locks on okay. your car. So what are you gonna do now? What are you guys gonna do? Man. Well, you're, you're calling you're police to, to give us a fine or something? No, 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 no. hold on, hold on, hold on. Listen, you're right. absolutely right. Thank you. you came from far away. Doesn't matter. Move the car. We're taking the car back. So we, we're taking the car. Why was it parked here in the first place? Sorry. Hmm? And now for an entitled woman. She starts calling the young guy recording old. It gets pretty crazy. You you need to stay within the lines. So do you. So do you. But look, look, I'm perfectly between the lines. Look, oh, I'm actually hugging this side a little too much. I'll take a picture. I'll take a picture. Yeah. But it's that's loca. You. Oh. You. In Espanol, por favor. Don't call women crazy. Burn. You're crazy. Look, you little You Oh. Driving a car like that. You're not happy, man. I'm. You're an old. I am. You're too old to be driving a car like that. It's big for you. I'm in disbelief. Pecker. Yeah, I bet you are. I, <laughs> look and you drive this, like it. This is something you drive original. like it, you little tiny. This is so you original. need that, that's your, that is your isn't it? No. You're proud of your old but it's your car, it ain't you. Yeah, you can't get it up. Viagra, my you stupid Now you're getting off fighting with a woman? No, I'm, I'm not you're fighting. You're getting off fighting with a woman, you I'm, little I'm not fighting at all. Go on, man, because I'll take you down, you son of a any time. That's, that's threatening, but it's not. It's, I'm just. Yeah. Park that correctly. I'm just being entertained, frankly. I'm in disbelief. No, no, it's okay. <laughs> she said I parked too close to her car. This entitled man was arguing with the cops to get out of trouble. Mira, este acá me para porque dice que vengo a 127 y vengo con la velocidad crucero a 110. Mira, a 110 vengo y me dice que vengo a 127. Ahora mostrame a ver dónde está la fotito. Mostrame dónde está la foto. Mostrame dónde está la foto. Mostrame dónde está la foto. Vení, mostrame, dale, mirá, acá está. Mirá todos los coches que tienen acá, mirá. Pescando giles como pelotudo, la policía de Córdoba, la caminera de Córdoba, mirá. Acá tenés el número de móvil, acá tenés uno haciendo la boleta. Mostrame dónde está la fotito, a ver, mirá. No hay nada, no tienen nada, flaco. Están pescando, nos toman de boludo, boludo, están recabando guita. ¿Dónde está tu identificación? Mostrame la identificación. Tiene mi nombre y apellido. Acá está. Acá tiene uno que no me dice nada. No, ¿qué explicación? Mostrame la foto. Mostrame la foto. Mostrame la foto. Mostrame la foto. No me expliqué. Mostrame la foto. Vos me mostrás la foto, yo cierro el orto, te pido disculpas y me veo la mierda. Mostrame la foto. Mostrame la foto. Vos me mostrás la foto, yo cierro el orto, te pido disculpas y me veo la mierda. Y haceme la boleta. No tenés la foto, capo. No tenés la foto, nos estás cagando, boludo, nos estás cagando. Vamos a crocharlo este también, a ver, mostrame la identificación tuya, a ver. Oficialmente vivas, Jorge. Sí, Déjame mostrar dónde lo tenés pegado. Ahí está. ¿Y dónde estás mostrando la foto, a ver? Acá me van pasando la foto. Mostrame la foto mía, mirá. Listo. Ahora un segundo. A ver, 108 KP. No, porque tengo que seguir laburando. Bueno, no sé qué No, vos estás recabando guita. Yo estoy laburando. Karen got caught shoving a few trinkets in her purse, and like Karen's do, she acted out. I've never even left the store, so good luck with that. Oh, I like this. Oh, I want to see the drama. You guys are all you. You guys are okay. I'm making that. Okay, I like it. So many stuff I want. Really? Okay. Yeah, I have nothing else. You inside, they want it. Yeah, you put it in your pocket. Okay. Give me my purse. I'm and I will leave. Yeah, police give come me in. my purse so I can leave. Police can't just take my purse out of me. I didn't even leave the store. Nothing. If you don't leave, there's nothing. You're stealing. Okay. If you think that was bad, take a look at what happened later. Inside, come in, yeah. 
I didn't leave the store though. I didn't do anything. Okay. I didn't leave any store. My hands were full. It was a box. You do not have to leave the store. Hang tight, hang tight. Don't move. I know. I'm just closing my hands. So she had it in her pocket? No, there was. It was addressed to her. Just hold it. 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 And now we have a crackhead Karen who was quite smart actually. She used a stroller to shoplift. Dude, get up off me, buddy. Can you please call your manager for I don't know what you're trying to do. I'm trying to take you, to take you to the manager. Oh my god. Look. Get away from me before I call the police. I'm recording everything. You can call the police if you want to. I'm just shopping like a normal person. I'm recording person. everything. I ain't doing nothing. Saying, you did not see me do okay. nothing. I'm recording and by no means. Okay, that's cool. Good for you. I'm just trying to shop, dude. What are you talking about? Take this out and take that out. Can you get all aggressive on me? Like, you gonna try to try your hands on me? I'm recording everything. A newborn? Are you serious? Okay. Don't, like, dude, let me talk to your manager, bro. Stop blocking my way, bud. That's false imprisonment. That's false imprisonment, bro. You're making me uncomfortable, bud. That's false imprisonment. Don't touch my stroller, bro. Can you open that up? Don't touch my stroller, bro. Don't touch my stroller, bro. Let me talk to your manager. Excuse me. Where's his manager at, please? She insisted on calling the manager, and this is what she gets in return. There is nothing under okay, here. Okay, move it, move it. Oh my God. It's yes, a banana. Right. Oh, banana. Oh, banana. Oh, big what? A banana. banana. Don't touch your breath. First of all, you're not touching your stuff. Get up off my bud. Get up off my Get up off my bro. Get up off. You ain't got to be all disrespectful, bro. Come on. Get up out of here. Here, Sean, get the rest of them. Thank you. Don't come yeah, back. I got some for you. The next male Karen really did not like the fact that this product was sold out. Karen, who tried and got caught stealing bottles. The worst part is, security was not the ones who stopped her. Oh, okay. I don't know the protocol. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, just take her. That's all you had to do, is take everything out. <laughs> Dude! No respect. <laughs> this Safeway has no respect. I'm just doing the video, man. Ignore me. Yikes. Security, doing nothing. <laughs> Coming up is a Karen who thought she could get away with cashing a fraudulent check. What branch is it supposed to be then? I don't know. I don't know the Well, then how are you telling her it's not what she's on the phone? Okay, but they can't verify the check. And I told her that's fine. I told her that I didn't even know why I got this far. I said, okay, if you can't verify the check, then fine. You can keep the check, give me a copy of the check, and give me back my ID. I told her that. And I, then I said, you know what, keep the copy of my, my check. All right, cut it, my cut it. I told her that. First of all, you cashed three of these or at least four of them within the last two days. That's fine. That has nothing to do with anything because they yes, owe me money true. from January working with this company. No, and I did not know that it was going to be all this. They done gave you three different information. That's not my fault. One minute, you, they can't verify with you. They all right, all right. With me. That's understandable. Stop understand. talking. Just let me go about my business then. That's what I said to you. Thank you. They're not pressing charges against me. Thank you, sir. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> no, I'm uh, not a fast talker. Okay. I told you. Can you just be quiet? All right, she's not. What am I supposed to do? She's not. Because I'm, I want to hear from her for a minute. But then this happens after the officer calls for backup. Who's that? Who's that? 
I did not steal anything. You can't even verify that I stole anything. So stop. Ma'am, she just verified that the, 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 the account's not right. No, she didn't verify that the account was right. He said, yes, I can't did. verify. No, what he said told her was, I cannot verify it with you. I have to verify it with the customer. Okay, hang on a minute. Hang on. I'm not keep you can keep the check. Keep it. That's why you don't care if I keep the check. I know I told her that I was keeping the first time. Give me the copy of it. I told her that. You have a right there. If they if they're gonna if they're if they're gonna um press charges on me, that's fine. Press the charges. I don't care, I'll go to court and I'll fight it myself. Give me right there. Put your phone down. I don't understand why I'm being arrested for it. Because they didn't verify the she, they, account she numbers. They can't so verify up. it. They said they can't verify it, so why am I being arrested? This next Karen actually took a woman's phone, but she didn't know that the woman's colleagues were watching her every move. for a woman who can store a whole lot of groceries in her trousers. Keep paying my app. Wait, 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 wait. Keep. Keep. Keep, I says. Keep. Keep. What's all for you? Keep. Keep us. It's a city failing with you. Get you on and keep her in Mele go. Keep. Keep. Yo. Keep us. Keep. 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 Key passes. Key pass off age. Keep. I gotta go born and now look at a keeper more. Fell later, Luce. I saw it. Come on, Rao. Let move. First up is a Karen that ran a stop sign, and then when confronted by a cop, she does this. Let me explain I it to you. I don't care. Okay. No. Relax. No. Relax. You know? Relax. And it's because these bitches on the street keep complaining because they have nothing okay. better to do. Well, I'm just going to say it off. You want to interrupt me? That's just on you. Okay. Pay the ticket is one. Two, no. you can take the no. traffic course, in no. which case you won't get the no. points. The last one is to pick a court or ticket okay. the court. Yes, I will see You have that. 30 days to pick whichever one you're going to do. Okay. If by chance you choose to do the no. traffic course, no. it has to be done wrong, within 30 days as well as okay. paying the ticket within the 30 days. Okay. You okay. understand? Along. Okay. You understand? I got, yes, I'm very clear. Okay. okay, can we move so, this along? This one, which is the insurance, which I'm assuming you're just going to show your proof, that's 114. This one for the stop sign is 164. Any questions for me? No, please. Let me just let me go. Good to go. Do we have a do you have a card? Yes. yes. I have proof that I've been targeted. I have proof. I mean, I don't like to make a big deal out of it or anything like that, but I know it's wrong. when you show a professional courtesy, agency it's to agency, it's wrong. why are you not? Just I'm doing my job. No, so you're, nothing. no you're not. You're getting complaints from these fucking bitches on the street. <laughs> No. no, I so work got, for you. Like, I'm going to get it taken care of. Yeah. I work no, for them. Relax. We've gotten complaints in Seven Oaks in general. I'm sure you've seen within the last couple of weeks, we've been in here a lot. And we've been citing the majority of the people. So, would you knock it off? The Karen recording the next clip really should have known she could not win an argument with this officer. Do you have any identification on you? 
What do you want? Badge, gun, handcuffs, okay. things. So, all right. Well, the reason why we're here is uh, bothering you on a Friday night is I guess you and some guy named Anthony were posting on social media that you were going to go trespass on a county commissioner's property, dump garbage on her property. I didn't say that I would dump garbage on her property. Well, that was the discussion that you guys were having, right? That's the discussion you guys were having. Um, so the no, reason it wasn't. I can show you the post. I if... plead the fifth. Okay. Okay. That's fine. So, uh, trespassing is a crime. Dumping garbage on people's property is a crime. So, don't do it. Okay. But you is that, plead, you plead is that why you all are here? Yeah. Yeah. Today's day and age, man. You're you're talking about trespassing on, you know. We didn't talk about trespassing, property. but okay. Well, going on somebody's property is trespassing, right? I didn't say any of those words. Okay. All right. That's cool. All right. Have a good night. Don't trespass. It's a crime. So all of this for that? This yeah. is just fear mongering. You know that, right? Fear mongering of what? Of a citizen for nothing. For nothing. Sorry you feel that way. I do. I'm putting my kids to bed and you're, you're wasting tax dollar money to come out here and... Tell you not to commit a crime? Yes. I'm not committing a crime and no, I I'm wasn't... I'm telling you not to commit a crime. Right, and I'm not planning on committing a crime. The following cop had a lot of patience with these cameras. Too bad it wasn't the same from their side. A private business owner such as Westfield, okay? This is where we might disagree, but let me, let me talk, okay? Okay. Part of their code of conduct for individuals going on their property is to uh, adhere to the mayor's safer LA public order, which is documented here, and I have copy for if you want one. In section five, is to when anyone's out, they have to wear a mask. Are they doctors? Listen, yeah. Are they doctors? Ma'am, this is yeah. Are the mayor's okay. doctors? Yeah. I want to know. It actually is a law. Because there are, no, it's not a law, it's a mandate. A mandate is a suggestion. Okay. We, we did not, we did not vote on it. We did not vote on it. this is where you're going to let me talk. Yeah, go ahead. And not attack me as a legislator. Yeah, let him finish. Listen to me as a public what? service yes. kind of, uh, representative yes. that's trying to do our best. And but you swore upon the Constitution too? Listen, listen. So, so if they want to not allow you to go on the property, and if you go on the property, then they want you arrested for 602.1 APC, which is trespassing. We will, listen to me, you might not agree with it, but we can't argue. We, by law, accept that arrest. And nope, we can nope. arrest them for not providing service no, to us for you can, public you accommodation. We can, can sue them. No, you can, you can sue them. This is an arrest. You can sue them yeah, for this is civil action. action. It's a civil action. There are a lot of people. Next, Karen thinks she can just handle their problems by screaming. Every time I just try to have a normal conversation with you, it just goes right to insults. Is that against the law? Is it no, is against the law to insult a man in blue? Do you understand how it's not a normal conversation? You guys get called why, shit all the time. And why we're concerned? And you get and you take down the blacks and you get fucking on video. That's false. Okay. <laughs> Jamie, we're Have a good day, Jamie. We're leaving. I want him arrested we're, we're, for physical assault. You face. We're not, we're not taking a report from you, Jamie. Especially when you guys scream like that. Have a good day. The woman recording the next video stood up to a cop but acted like a Karen while she was doing it. So if I don't turn it down, what? Right, so you're gonna because I'm not in violation of anything. It's either, not, you can step out. Either A, you're going to get a citation or B. You can't, you can't citate me. Right. And you can't arrest me either. So with the citizen complaint? It doesn't matter. Because, so, first of all, the complaint, the you, you can come and tell, you can right. cite, you can so cite right me. now, right now? No. They, you can they, cite they me? Said, they said that Who's you're they? bothering somebody. Who's they? You're bothering someone's Who's private, they? um, Who's piece, they? okay? So I already told so who is you they? that you are. No, you and are I am telling you, piece, it doesn't okay? matter. And if you're you bothering mine. Up, if you turn and, it and back you're up, mine. you're going to be arrested. Okay? You can't arrest me. You have any questions? You don't can't arrest me. Okay. So what law am I violating? What law am I violating? What law? What law am I violating? Citizen, arrest for No. You're going to be arrested. What okay? law am I violating? What law am I violating? What law am I violating? I'm not violating any law because guess what? It ain't past ten. What is your name and badge number? What name and badge number? You can't deny me that. If I ask you for a name and badge number, you have to give it to me. Name and badge number? Here you go. I'm asking you for your name and badge number. Here you go. Can you name read badge? it? Nope. I can't. Actually, okay. I'm illiterate. What's your name and badge You're number? Illiterate. I am. My name's Officer Rusko. Name your badge number? 14104. Here you go. Thank you. If, if, I'm not if violating. I come back, you will am be arrested. I, I will not. Okay. Bet. The cops in this next clip should have been finding the people that called them, but not the guys recording. Ma'am, if you can, can you tell me what we did wrong? I told you, it's a two gas maximum. It's a two gas maximum. This my family. Look, he got a wristband. She, he got a wristband. Look, they're my two cousins. So what's wrong? So what's wrong? So now you're not trying to say anything because you're on camera. Bro, I'm not even trying to do this. That's the thing. You, you did this to us. What were we doing wrong? 
Look, she got the cops just because we all black, fam. I feel like this is the real reason. Just admit it. Just admit it. Because look, bro, look at all these people out here and you worried about us. Let them have it, fam. Don't God, I'm not even finna argue with you. That's what I'm saying. So many families outside, but they want to come get us. Are you racist? Just be honest. Are you racist? Are you racist? So y'all y'all not gonna say anything. Y'all just call the cops for no reason, just cause we black. Next is a Karen that demands an officer's badge number so that she can get his indemnity insurance. What's going down, this crazy lady? I'm ready to go. Yeah? Yeah. I'm ready to go in. Does this open up further? You guys, they do have the right to. Yeah. And then I, can I you cannot touch me! Back up. You cannot, you cannot touch me. You cannot go inside. You cannot, you cannot touch me. You cannot go inside. Can you? Not, you cannot go inside. You allowed your arm to touch my body and block my free movement. You cannot go inside. You're not the you boss of me. Go inside. You're not the boss of me. You cannot go inside. God, then go inside. man and woman, then government, then corporation, then employee. You cannot go inside. You cannot go inside. You cannot, go inside. Okay, you cannot block my free movement. You cannot block my free movement. What is your badge number? ID 7090. And I will be contacting the department so I can get your indemnity insurance. I'm saying this to police. You can't touch him. This Karen thinks it's okay to just grab kids at a park. She quickly realized that that's not how it's done in the UK. You're gonna get arrested, bro. Get off me now. Get off me. You're Alex. Why did you speak with me like that? Why did you speak with me like that? Why did you speak with me like that? Why did you push me? Yeah, you type that when she push me? What? Did you take that when she push me? Yeah, because you was coming me showing in my face. This young man shot down the male Karen that tried to bully him in the best of ways. If you want me to go over there, I'll get the police to come over here and escort you off his property. All right? Just because you're acting like a big boy in front of these guys that can skate, Joe, he can film it all he wants. Film what? I don't care. Go ahead, act like a clown in front of him. I, I'm not a clown. And I'll call them over here and escort you off the property. I'm not in the circus. I'm not a clown. Clowns belong in the circus. I'm not a clown. Please don't talk about me. And act your age. I might. I hear you say what I heard you say before. I'll grab you by your shirt and drag you. Nah, around. you won't touch me. You want to bet? Yeah. And I'll do it in front of these guys too with him filming. Oh, well, you can do it in front of my baby. Excuse me? You can do it in front of my baby. You're a little idiot. I'm a little idiot. Yes, you are. But did I go to college? And get some wheels and trucks on that thing. Yeah, get some wheels. Next is a Karen who is against these kids trying to get a good catch. They reel him in real quick. Well, get back in the water, man. Maybe his brother and sister are over there. Right. Yeah. <laughs> that's a good thumbnail. That was a nice way. Yeah, okay. I grew up here. All my life, I've never seen anybody fishing with Really? Yeah. <laughs> You know what, though? I, I've been down here many years, and I didn't grow up here, but I've been down here probably 20 years, and I've seen people fishing here forever. It's kind of dangerous when there's a kid here. Oh. That's funny. If you don't know, it's kind of coming for handy, the Karen coming up had no right to try and discipline someone else's child, but they showed her exactly how they felt about it. A lot of us don't act like that, though. So. Exactly. But for those of you who do and don't have a sense enough to put a cork in it when asked to be respectful, thank you. But you should do it a whole lot harder. Tell her. Tell mom. You tattling? Mom is gonna. You're gonna get grounded for yeah. tattling. Mom's gonna ground the hell out of you. No, sure. Hey. You. No, the heck. Wait till mom comes to pick me up. No, there are enough F words coming out of his mouth that he should be ashamed of what he said. And he said his mother didn't hear, nor did his dad. <laughs> Don't listen to him, he's crazy. Well, he's just messing no. with you. He's just messing with you. Well, I hope no. his parents see I have his mom's number, you want to call and her? And I hope she grounds him for eternity. <laughs> Because you have been served, my man. <laughs>
The next Karen decided to bully a teenager that was just trying to do her workout. She didn't know what was coming her way. Hey, listen to me. We don't play games here anymore, okay? Next time you ever talk to me like that, you're gonna get your ass kicked by my family. They're gonna f you up. What did That's I do? Right. They're gonna f Why? Up. What did I do? Because you are an a Look at the whole stairs to yourself. But you had these Why stairs and that stairs. Why don't you go somewhere else where you can go to a gym? This is not just for you. Get the f out of this world. Get the f out of this state. Okay, race. Don't you ever say, oh, Jesus, to me when I want to use the stairs, you little b There's other stairs. You are a sick Ignorant teenager. Oh, oh thank you. Fucking what, middle-aged woman? <laughs> Who wears black in California sun? Who the f*** wears black? Are you an idiot? You wear black in California sun? Seriously? This next Karen messed with the wrong skate park teenagers and got fined for it. Whoa! 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 No! You call me out of again. No! We will be Next clip is a male Karen coming across another male Karen and his son. It gets quite verbally heated. Get away from me, or it's gonna get it. Howard is running away. Turn around, have a conversation. I work for the government. You're not working anymore. You Are you claiming to be an RCMP member? Yes. You, you work for the public. Well, that's great, buddy. I'm gonna put this to the RCMP. Tell them to have a member running around claiming to be an officer. Okay? Nope. Impersonating an officer's a crime, buddy. Yeah, buddy. You <laughs> Karen, beat it, Karen. <laughs> Oh, a YouTube celebrity! My God! Come chase me! Come chase me! Come chase me! Are you angry? No! But I will do. Yeah, of course it is, because you're a racist. You're a racist pig! This Karen got really angry at her 14 year old boy, but he definitely put her in her place. You just tried hitting me with your car! You That's just so! You're not as tough as you think you are. I know I'm not tough. Right I know I'm not tough. Home. Exactly, and you're not gonna touch That's my phone. I'll put my phone in your face. You're not gonna you? assault me. You're, you're not gonna, gonna walk towards me. Put your goddamn phone in a gutter. Do it. But how about you keep do it? it? Out of the. I, I listen, 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 yeah, we got all this on video. Have fun. I'll, I'll have a great time. I'll have a great time. Now for a couple of Karens that literally think they own the road. Their neighbor's parents were visiting, so this is how petty the Karens got. Is there a problem? Yeah, move your car out of the way. You can record me all you yeah. want. I don't give a f Cool. Record me. Go for it. So what is what is the issue? Okay, shut What's up. the issue? Shut up. What's the issue? Shut up. She's upset. Move the car. Out She's of the upset way. because there's a car me. parked here. Me. Last time I checked, this park it's this is legal. She thinks she thinks that this is her parking area. So she decides to park in front of my house. Yeah, okay. She decides to park in front of my house. I don't give a fuck. Cool. No, hey, call the tow truck, dude. Call the cops. I got. You don't own that side of the street. You don't own it. Hey, call the cops away. Don't even just we're gonna call the cops and they're gonna tow this my, shit. Like, my parents are stopping by for like an hour. But you don't own that. Look at look at these fools. Look at these fools. Look at these fools. They they think they own this right here. They think they own this part of the street. Look at this. Embarrassing, dude. Embarrassing, dude. And look, look at you, you guys. You, are. you guys don't own this. You can't keep your car in that no. side of the street. No. You guys don't own this, though. You guys don't own this. Yes, we do. No, you don't own this right here. No, not the car. No, but you don't own this. Are you, you don't own this. Back? Are you guys that stupid? This you own? Are you guys that stupid? This you own? Not this. No. Next, we have a Karen that is demanding for her order of Popeyes. Little does she know, the manager is on her way. Listen, you work in here. You work in here making. Call the police. Call, call the police. I do not have my cell phone. Listen, 
there. I don't care about you. Okay, so what are you, what are you talking about? See your out of this conversation. You come down. I don't need to come down. You can Now, what you listen? What are you, listen, Derek, take your This woman's husband has to come out and deal with her because she absolutely refuses to sign delivery papers. She claims she was the number one most honest person in America. Hey, hey, so wait, don't you. touch my car. I'm it's, not touching your truck. It's my truck. Okay, uh, then I won't touch your truck. Hey, don't I won't touch your truck. Hey, don't touch your truck. I'm not touching your truck. Hey, I'm not touching your truck. I'm Shh. touching what I bought. Hey. This is not your truck. This is not your truck. It's water that I paid no, for. No, it's in my truck. No, it's right not now, it's in, in your truck. Please, move. Move. You know your asshole. Yes. I wish you nothing but harm. Mm -hmm. I put it back. No, you get out of my garage. This is my garage. This is my garage. That's your truck. This is my garage. Well, you sign it, it's yours. You're not signing it. I want my water that I paid for. You're refusing to give it to me. No. Yes, you are. No, I never do that. They deliver and I sign it. So you sign that paper. Here, let me sign it. Let me sign it. You gotta cross all okay, that shit under up. duress. Okay, where's your pen? Under duress, you have forced me to sign this. And you have caused me emotional and mental damage. Right. Don't call me a liar, Drake. I am probably the honest person in the whole United States. I don't go around lying. I don't go around calling people cheaters. Now for a Karen that thinks because she's been vaccinated, she doesn't have to wear a mask, but she still insists other people go shop in different aisles than her. You can't let them buy? No, I can't because they get within my six foot when they go by. No, I can't. They can either back up or they can go do some other shopping and come back when I'm done. This is you ain't doing nothing but confronting me, all right? You're the aggressor here, not me. We were literally just trying to go down the aisle. Like I said, there's a six foot law. You ain't literally trying to do nothing but make me sit and go to the hospital. I'm fully vaccinated, if that makes you feel it's better. It's irrelevant because it mutated, honey. Don't act like you're stupid. You know exactly what you're doing. What? If you want everybody to stay away from that's fine. No, we're not allowed to say something. I don't have freedom of speech around here. Hey, Tori, it's all being polite. Hey, they're going to kill me, and you think that's polite? They're not going to kill you. If they got some kind of COVID that's mutated. Please, please. Why aren't you wearing a mask if you're so worried? Because I've been vaccinated, but it's irrelevant because the COVID mutated. Right, right. So right. I could still get it. I just want people to back up. Well, sweetheart, don't cuss them and be polite and let them shop. Go stand in the middle. When I'm done selecting what I'm going to select, they can go over for This is not six feet. You need to move over for other customers and get that woman. You want to go to jail today? You want to come back to her? You want to go to jail today? Excuse me. Go ahead. You want to go to jail today? You, you tap me and hurt one more time and you're going to jail. Okay? You're the one that grabbed a hold of my car. I moved your car like I asked you to move. Now, will you please get out of the middle of the aisle? You're fired. You don't know who you're dealing with. I'm going to get my boss right now. This TikTok influencer was not going to let Karen get the best of them. Next time you sit on a bench, you can say, excuse me, ma'am, do you mind if I sit here? Why would I do that? It's a, it's a public setting. Have you been living under a rock? Do you know about coronavirus? Yeah, and I know you're not wearing a mask, so you clearly don't care about coronavirus. You also know that I stay away from people. How am I supposed to know that? It's a public bench. If you don't want someone to sit next to you, then get up. You're rude. You're rude. I saw the disgusting look you gave me and my friend. I do. There's Gladys, Miss Sweet Gladys. Let me tell you something. Tell Gladys it. Tell it. There's royalty. Thank you very much. Oh, well, she's so royal. Karen is recording this next video, and she is making a complete fool out of herself. You don't have a store manager that's a man? So who is, what's your store manager name? Allison. Allison? Okay, so it's Allison. So who did I speak to the other day? Who was the man that was over the store just uh, last week that I reported? Is it Jonathan? I do not know. I have him on footage. Yeah, he's not, he's not, um, like, he's up front. 
No, okay, so he Steve, was a store manager. Are you now is Allison the store manager? She's a store manager, yes. She's considered the store manager. Like she's she, not an assistant manager or anything. No, she's a store okay, manager. did you tell me that you was the store manager just a few seconds ago? I'm one part of one of the leaders around here. No, but I thought you said you were the store manager. When she's not on duty, I'm in charge of everything around. But I asked here. you, okay, were you the store you manager, you and I'm you said you were a store I'm manager? I'm not going to with you. What you need? Okay, so I just want to know who the store manager is because you said you were a store manager, okay. and then when I started to get need? my phone out, you said you were team lead. I'm not going to stay here and argue with you. What do you need? Okay, well I thought the customer was always right, so I'm not arguing. The customer's I'm... always right, but I'm not going to argue with you. Okay, thank you. So I'm right, so stand here. Anyway, <laughs> all right. Mara, you need me? Let me get another associate. I'm sorry, you guys. Let me find someone who um, acts like Target is actually a corporation and not a neighborhood store. But the reason she did all of this was just for bug spray. Are you the assistant manager? I thought you said you were a team lead. The team lead is over the whole store today? Yes, Alex is not here. A team lead can be over the whole yes, store? Yes, yes. Okay, well, no, that's not correct because I call corporate. Huh? That's not correct. Where's the assistant manager at? Right here. How can I help Okay, you? hi, assistant manager. I cannot believe you can actually say that you were over the whole store today. Uh, I just got here. Okay. So I'm going to just complain about the prices. This is $7.49, and this is also $7.49. The kids spray and the adult spray. Next up, we have a Karen that was caught shoplifting and left without her infant. Right. Be quiet. I am not leaving without paying for anything. Yeah, no, The cop that's dealing with her is handling it well too. Todo, todo. Es la primera vez que lo hacía, la había checado antes. Es demasiado, es demasiado. Abajo. No. Next are two Karens and one child. They thought it was a great idea to steal things. One got away, the other, well, let's just take a look. We are stealing. They will not let me out the door. I try to get him my purse and everything, and he still won't let me out the door. He don't keep calling laws and everything. <coughs> I tried to show him my bag and everything. And he him. And I'm showing this in my bag, and he still won't let me out the door. Tell him he pushed you and put his hand right in there. Tell him. Tell him. I don't give a f you push him. No. Just when we thought Walmart's were carrying free again, these two. Hey, nah, nah, you got the babies, baby. Hey, don't do that. You got the babies, yo. Y'all got the babies, babe. I'm 
Not only did this next Karamek fool of herself in front of her daughter, she did it in front of her granddaughter too. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. You gotta step on her first. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. You are not taking my purse. Leave me alone. You cannot have my purse. Alone. I am not in your store. Give me my card. Give me my stuff. Please come. Right, I'll go with you. Yes. Yes. Alone. No, come on, Coming up is a British Karen who freaked out in front of everyone. I don't need to worry. You look wonderful. It's not something that you really need to worry about. Are you for real? Amazing. You don't know me. You don't know my life. You don't know my backstory. You don't know my situation. How can you sit there and say, I look wonderful? Well, thank you. That's really nice of you, but you don't know what's going on. No. You don't know what I've been through. So putting this down here on this table for me to see makes it very difficult for me. Do you understand that? I completely, completely. But you don't, completely. because or else you wouldn't have done it. Please. No, please. I won't actually. Please. There are other people. Here. I don't care. No. Please. I'm sure they agree with me. This is ridiculous. Right. This obviously this situation is really, really quite quite tense and quite Yes, it is tense. We didn't mean to do anything to upset you like that. <laughs> The, honestly, honestly, these menus are brand new. I don't They're care. I asked you specifically. I came in here and I asked you specifically. I don't. You've obviously not listened, so you're not doing your job very well, are you? No, no, we have. I've no. asked you specifically for those. Yeah. What you've done is ignore me and brought these anyway. Now I've got to sit here and read that. Madam. And you don't understand how difficult that is for me to sit here and read. Next is a couple who were clearly meant to be together, but don't see parents if they bring their child into an environment like this. I'm waiting on the police to get here. Okay, I'm gonna wait for them to get here, and then we gonna we gonna discuss it from here on out. I'm sorry, what you say? You say what, bro? You say? Why you keep talking and shaking your head, bro? What you say? What are you saying? What you say? So what did you say to me? Mind your business. 